Here in North Carolina, we have 36 species of carnivorous plants, with the most notable being the Venus flytrap, but we have other species as well. The butterwort is a species of carnivorous plant that has a whole bunch of leaves at its base that are covered in a sticky residue. So once the insect gets trapped on there, it will release a digestive enzyme and consume their prey. We also have a couple different species of sundews. They have a sticky pad that is covered with sticky hairs. And once the prey animal gets trapped in the sticky hairs, they will use that pad to curl around itself, sending out digestive enzymes to consume their prey, leaving just the exoskeleton behind. Then we have the bladder warts, which are mainly aquatic species of carnivorous plant. They have a tiny bladder that's covered in hair that releases a trap door when triggered, and then it will suck in their prey. And this happens in about 3.5 milliseconds, which is really fast. Lastly, we have pitcher plants, which are long stemmed and they are filled with rainwater and digestive enzymes. They make it really easy for a bug or an insect to get down into the pitcher, but have a really hard time getting out. 